Meteorologist Matt Sandrich is here now to talk more about our weather. And, you know, gosh, those folks out there, I think there's a little more humidity out west, but that is like less than a drop in the bucket for them, right? I wish we could share some of the humidity that we have here yeah. with them. Right. They could definitely use it. Those pictures, uh, Lena, it's crazy. We've seen a lot of pictures mm -hmm. online. We've been showing it for you guys for the past couple of days as well. And what's crazy is that we have a tiny bit of smoke in our atmosphere too, especially in Western Ohio. Picks up a little bit more in Indiana, a little bit more in Illinois, but it's journeyed over 2,000 miles to come to the Buckeye State. Now we kind of have our own weather problems going into the evening hours. It was a beautiful start this morning. Hopefully you had a chance to enjoy your Saturday morning, but as we progress throughout the afternoon, the clouds have increased a little bit. And now this is what we're watching, rain and and some thunderstorms will be popping up later this evening into the overnight hours. We actually have a few downpours out there right now. They are few and far between, and the ones that we do have are pretty small. If you zoom in just a little bit closer, one of our most impressive ones you see on radar is really not much at the moment. We have it coming into Lake County. Leroy, we're about to get some of that rain. And then once you head a little bit south towards uh, Richland County, Ashland County, and, and uh, also Holmes County, we got a couple downpours kind of following Interstate 71 north and east, eventually towards downtown Cleveland. It's thanks to the southwesterly winds we have. There's that warm front. You know, it's warm, it's humid. A lot of us are still sitting uh, in, the, in the 70s, headed towards the 80s right now. There's that warm front, though, but we are watching rain towards our west and towards our south. You see it on satellite and radar, and eventually all this is headed towards northeast Ohio. Rain chances will continue to increase throughout the evening hours. So that's something we'll definitely be looking for as the clouds continue to increase. Right now it's 82 degrees in Mansfield, about 79 in the upper 70s throughout the downtown area, Cleveland, and 79 also in Ashtabula. As we head throughout the next several hours, we'll cool down just a little bit, but as the temperatures cool down just a hair, the rain chances will go up. And just talking about your rain chances going to your Sunday, Lake Erie is gonna be kind of choppy with the thunderstorms and the rain showers, especially in the morning. There's a lot of boats out there today enjoying the nice summer-like weather, but that's going to change over the next couple of hours. Let me walk you by the National Design Mar hour-by-hour hour forecast. As we head throughout the rest of the evening, we'll have a few of these downpours here and there coming in from the southwest towards the northeast, but those rain chances will start to ramp up as we head into tomorrow morning. Jason Frazier is going to help you get out the door. Make sure you check with him as you head out for your Sunday morning, but the rain's going to become a little bit more widespread for your Sunday morning, eventually clearing out once we have this front push through. Now, we're not talking a lot of severe weather, but there could be a few rumbles of thunder as this rain pushes throughout Northeast Ohio. Here's kind of a timeline of what we're thinking throughout the rest of the evening. Most of us should stay dry the next couple of hours, but the rain chances are increasing and then they maximize right around sunrise tomorrow morning. Universal Windows Direct Northeast Ohio Outlook shows that we have those rain chances for your Sunday morning. But I do think by about three o'clock tomorrow afternoon, the rain should pretty much subside. We could stay kind of cloudy the rest of the day, but at least we're gonna clear out the rain and we'll have some stiff Northwest winds. You see a drop in that temperature for your Monday. Slowly we rebound though, back into the middle of the week. Lena, it's looking very nice next week. I know it was kind of nice today, but even nicer weather headed into next week, also with less humidity.